Hi, today we're talking about Corporate Social Responsibility, or CSR, and we're particularly privileged to talk to John Chambers, the CEO of Cisco. So thank you, John, for joining us. So this is a question I get from mm -hmm. a lot of different people. The employees ask me this, as well as uh, my peers in the mm -hmm. industry. Customers ask me this, and mm -hmm. some of the public sector leaders I talk to, which is that you are a very busy man, and I've known mm -hmm. you for 20 years, and I know how busy you are. You're in here in the middle of the night and, and work all night on telepresence, connecting mm -hmm. with customers around the world. Mm -hmm. uh, people need you to be here to interface with customers who visit. You're overseeing big organizational changes. And yet you make the time to go places like, you know, to in Mississippi and Louisiana, to go to the uh, to Sichuan province where there was an earthquake. How do you find the time to do that? It would be so much easier just to, to write a check. And I know mm -hmm. you do both personally mm -hmm. and uh, and through the company in a very mm -hmm. significant way. But how do you? Why and how do you take the time to really invest in going personally and getting personally engaged in some of these you know massive programs that we run? Well, first for all of you out there, both the Cisco family, but also many others watching from around the world, we encourage you to get involved. That can be either time or it can be financial, mm -hmm. and we'll take that. Mm -hmm. But from a leader point of view, I only have four jobs. Vision and strategy of the company, development and recruitment of the team to implement that vision and strategy, culture, and communicate all the above. And communicate means be the example. Culture is such a huge part of who we are. And culture, when we focus on our customers, I need to lead by that. I need to be out with customers, listening to what we're doing right, right. helping the sales organization right. sell, listen to things we have to change. Same thing is true on corporate social responsibility. People need you the most when you have a disaster or when they're in trouble. And yet that's very often when people hesitate about getting involved. So being involved both at the time that the disaster occurs to show that we're really committed, we'll be there for mm -hmm. you, together we can, we can deal with this, but also to be there six months, 12 months, 18 months later. The earthquake in Sichuan province going back again and again, interfacing to the same young children that we yeah. saw that were so much affected by it, or in the amputee center, learning how people can really make a difference there, or watching an economic area recover, or young people's eyes light up when they say, because of the education, I now have a job, and here's what we can do together. Mm -hmm. So it's the right way to see what's going well and where you have to improve. It also sets the example for what each of us expect of our team.